What's up, everybody? It's Lindsay here. Um, today, I'm going to be showing you all a very, very cool makeup look. Um, it was requested to me a while ago. Um, it's uh, an Ava Levine makeup look, uh, one that she wore in uh, the year of 2004 to uh, Juno Awards and um, to a couple other award winning uh, shows and uh, the red and orange kind of makeup look. Um, I'm going to be showing you a couple of the photos that I'm going to be looking at when doing my makeup. So here they are. So, um, at the end of this video, make sure to look into the video description box, which is over there. And I'll have all of the list of all of the um, makeup products that I use, and where to get a couple of them. Comment, rate, subscribe if you haven't, um, if you like my videos. If you don't, it's completely fine with me. Um, so I'll be showing you this look right away. See you guys. I'll show you pictures at the end too so that y you can see the outcome of the makeup uh, through a higher quality because lighting in here kind of sucks right now. I hope you guys, um, hope you guys enjoy this look. So here it goes. Rock on. Alright, so we are going to start. This is what I'm going to be doing. She also wore this for a Saturday Night Live. We're going to start with this. We're going to start with primer. Uh, this is Instant Firming Face Primer by a Revlon. A dab of that and just put it on your, on, uh, your eyelid and anywhere else you're going to be putting makeup. Um, we're going to be putting some on our nose. Primer is to prepare your face for a um, makeup application. So I'm on the cheekbones. If you don't have any, you can always use highlighter or um, anything close to that. But if you don't have it, it's fine. You don't have to use it. It's not required. Remember, um, I don't like to go out all out on the uh, expensive makeup kind of techniques everybody does. And next, we're going to go with Revlon uh, Beyond Natural. This is a uh, Conclave that's highlighter. Mine's in 300 light pale. If you don't have it, it's fine. Foundation, whatever. This double-sided brush. Um, Conclave application, highlighter application. So just like patch up any spots that you believe, um, like like blotches or pimples, red spots. Now take the uh, highlighter brush and. And we're going to contour our nose. It doesn't really matter how much you put on as long as you can s see a difference in the tone of your nose. And keep make sure you only do it on the ridges, don't do it on the sides. Make sure you give yourself a little button nose on the top. These are always good to keep in handy with you, um, the uh, sponge applicators. This is my 120 Pro Palette. This color in the middle, which is red, we're going to call that a red. <laughs> it's like a light red there. And this. It's like an orange red. And some of that right there. Bright orange. You don't have to though. You can use any kind of eyeshadow application for this as long as it's similar colors. You can even use blush. I used to use blush for my red eyeshadow. I'm going to start off with the orange red. I'm just going to gently swipe this across uh, your eyelid. Don't go past the crease until you get out towards uh, the outer corner of the eye and uh, make circular uh, brush strokes. The red, the light red. Swipe, uh, swiping it across just the whole lid as well. I'm going to add some to this and we're going to take a little bit of that orange up there. Just put that on. So that's what you should have. 
Now take a blending brush, just any kind of blending brush, and just blend that all in. Now we're going to take a small little um, smudge brush, and you're going to dip that in the same red orange. Tap it, tap off excess, and go right underneath your waterline. And next, we're going to do a liquid eyeliner. Do it on only the top. Make the line as thin as possible. We're going to move on to the eyeliner. I'm using Auto Eyeliner by LA Colors. Um, like how it looks and how it feels on my eyes. Be careful not to pull your uh, eyes down too much. You don't want wrinkles or you don't want your eyes sagging as you grow older. Because they will. Mm -hmm. Should have that. And now we'll finish with um, Lash Blast Waterproof Mascara in Hydrofuse Black. Wiggle the wand and curl it. Wiggle, curl, or twist, you could say. Wiggle, twist, wiggle, twist, maybe move your head down when you're doing it. And it's guaranteed to pop your lashes. In this uh, picture, She looks like she's wearing, um, she looks like she's wearing a lip gloss. So this is just a sea water. Just take any like light pink, glossy lip gloss, something kind of lavender like, and finish with powder brush. Spin in your eyes. And on your cheeks, get all that access, makeup off of your cheekbones. Now I'm gonna use a pair of really cool aviators. This. No, I was joking. Okay, so I hope you like this tutorial. I'll have pictures at the end. Um, this is actually a really fun makeup look. So, um, I, did, I hope you liked it. I hope everything was really cool and I hope you followed along well. I hope the tips were great. If you have any questions, comments, feel free. Um, subscribe, uh, tell your friends, share this video whatever, but I hope you liked it, um, I know I do, so I'll be talking to you guys later, and uh, check out the pictures at the end, see ya, rock on. It's there